The words walking and football don't necessarily go together. However, this group of over 50s meet twice a week at Five Rivers Leisure Centre in Salisbury to do exactly that. The sport, walking football, is aimed at the older generation. And although based on the traditional game of footy, there are a few rule changes, namely no running and no slide tackles to avoid injuries. This group in Salisbury was started three years ago when there was nothing of its kind in South Wiltshire and it's grown dramatically since then. The first session here, seven people turned up, six men, one female. Now um, there's three of us still playing. As elderly people, we should be out there trying to get fit. I've met maybe 30 or 40 men I would never have met in real life and that's important to me. I'm not stuck at home, I want something to do. Monday, Fridays, I can come down here and, and get back to the spot I love. This club now has 50 members and they've been nominated for a Community Team of the Year award in the city. But for the team it's about much more than the game. The group in here is really about the social side of it and I want to get people from all different sort of backgrounds um, different abilities, different capabilities, coming along together and want to play as a, as a sort of social game of football. So the football is important, but more importantly is, is the social aspect as well. We don't join so many clubs as males, uh, a bit more reserved than the ladies are. Um, so to get people like this and now to get sort of 20, 30 people coming along um, is really good. Some of the guys haven't kicked the ball for 40 years um, and now they're just trying it for the first time again and actually enjoy everything about it. For the older generation, there are great health and fitness benefits to this form of exercise. One player's fitness monitor showed he had walked 7.3 kilometres in a two-hour session. And for one team member, the health benefits have been life-changing. I'm a type 1 diabetic, have been for 38 years. My medical team wanted me to find something that was regular exercise. Tried running, tried walking, tried the gym didn't find any satisfaction at all. A friend of mine at church um, suggested walking football as I was over 50. So here I am and it's the best thing I've ever done. And my medical team are made up with the results it's already showing. I've been coming three or four months and um, it's great. And I think the difference is that I'm playing with a bunch of like-minded friends as they are now. Um, camaraderie is marvellous and it's a win-win situation for me. Whilst players have to be over 50 to join, there's no upper age limit and the oldest member of the team is 78. For him, the sessions have a wide range of benefits. I used to always used to play football and um, I thought then when I retired I thought that was the end of that you know no more exercise for me sort of thing other than playing golf and things um, but then this opened up uh, a possibility for you know fo football type exercise which I which I found very important anyway. Benefits are keeping you uh, sort of mobile and reasonably, reasonably fit. Also uh, the skills on the field and interpersonal skills. The club runs sessions every Monday and Friday morning. They're now looking to start a female team, as well as to launch another session aimed at new starters to ease them into the game. Rhea Barton, That's TV.